Hello and welcome to Megor's technical support video series, Frequently Asked Questions. In this video, we will review features of the Megor DLRO100 Low Resistance Tester. Let's get started. The DLRO100 enables low resistance measurement across multiple applications in areas without access to mains power. The integral Li-Ion battery supplies a constant 100 amp current for up to 200 manual or automatic tests to enable enhanced productivity in remote locations. The rugged design, intuitive interface and IP54 rating ensure reliability and ease of use in the most arduous of conditions. Key specifications of the DLRO100 include resistance measurement range from 0.1 micro ohm to 2 micro ohm with a resolution of 0.1 micro ohms, 100 millivolt differential noise rejection, a smooth DC output, a battery life of 200 single tests at 100 amps or two 10 minute tests at 100 amp continuous. It has a maximum output voltage of 2 volts on the battery and 3 volts with AC. More details can be found on the Mega website us.mega.com. Now let's review the different models available in the DLRO100 series. The DLRO100E and EB has advanced features of configurable tests, manual, auto and continuous test modes. The DLRO100X and XB has internal memory storage for test records and USB connectivity in addition to the DLRO100E and EB features. The DLRO100H and HB have Bluetooth, remote operation and smart device capability in addition to DLRO100X and XB features. Let us review the front panel of the DLRO100. First is the test mode rotary switch. It includes an off position. The instrument switches on by rotating the switch clockwise from this position. Test modes provided are manual, automatic and continuous. Next, we will discuss the range rotary switch. It has a light blue colored section which denotes memory functions such as delete records, download records via USB or Bluetooth, and retrieve records for the DLRO100X and H models. Then a spanner symbol is available for enabling instrument and test settings. Next, a test selections menu that includes a custom range or preset test currents of 10 amps, 50 amps, and 100 amps. Other front panel buttons include navigation, test initiation, backlight, save functions for the DLRO 100X and 100H models. The front also has continuity indicators for current and potential probes. Now let's take a look at the side panel. It has current terminals, potential terminals, a measurement earth terminal, and the dual ground terminal for the 100X and 100H models. Next, we have the power socket and USB device port for the 100X and 100H models. Leads options for the DLRO100 series include the standard lead set with separate current and potential leads, the Kelvin lead set with a single clamp arrangement for both current and potential, lastly, terminal adapters can be used with existing leads to connect to the DLRO100 low resistance ohm meter. For more information regarding types of lead sets, please watch the lead setup and connections video for the DLRO100 series low resistance testers. This concludes review of the Mega DLRO100 series low resistance testers. Visit the Mega YouTube channel for more videos including technical webinars, product overviews, and other how-to presentations similar to this one. Contact us for questions or more information about this topic or for any support you may need for your electrical testing.